All right, team, what's going on? I'm Tim Jenkins, and welcome to All Things QB. Today, we are checking in on Russell Wilson and the Denver Broncos offense and how they did week four against the Raiders. So if you're a Broncos fan, hit that subscribe button, or if you just like breakdowns in general, hit the subscribe button, turn the notification bell on, because I'll be breaking down the Denver Broncos every Monday on this channel. And know that I'm a huge FTA guy, which means comment for the algorithm, and then please like this video. So the question we're going to try to answer is, will Russell Wilson figure this thing out? And... I'm hoping through the film to answer that or kind of decide, okay, is it too early, too late, whatever it may be. So without further ado, let's jump into the film. First one we've got for you guys is the first big play of the game. Probably the one you guys all remember. We've got a little tight end scene, okay? So what they're working is Y dagger. So they've got this tight end right here, or Y, right? He's working the seam. You got Cortland, Cortland Sutton, sorry, out here, and he's working the big end, right? That's the dagger concept. They're going to work it off a little play action, right? We're going to have play action to the right. Russ does a great job of seeing that the linebackers came up with that play action, okay? Watch these linebackers come up on the play action and then just driving this thing right behind. Really big time throw, great catch, good concept. Love this one from the Broncos, okay? Love this one. Man, it was a... Uh... Yeah, it was a tough day. Tough day for Broncos fans. Tough day for us. Okay, good play action here, though. And really good job. Good aggressive throw under pressure. Dime, great catch. Love that. Love that. Love that. Okay, then we got the follow-up. We got the touchdown in the red zone where he just does a really good job. Okay, I want you guys to watch Cortland Sutton here. I'm not going to drop everything because this is really more of like a, hey, hangs onto the ball. But he's going to work back here, and then he's going to end up working this. That was a terrible drawing, but he's going to work the back baseline. Russ does a really good job of buying time in the pocket, staying calm in the pocket, letting Sutton work. Sutton works that back baseline. Big time throw. Really, really good catch. Really good awareness to know where you are in that end zone and not drift, right? Not drift up vertically and into the back of the end zone. Big time stuff. Big time, big time stuff. Next one we've got for you is we've got a really, really good ball here to Jerry Judy, okay? They've got mesh, right? They're trying to work mesh. But if you've got this one-on-one -on -one shot, go ahead and take it. Really, your progression would be like one to two to three. But you would pre-snap alert this versus one-on-one, -on -one, okay? That's not a bad draw. That's not bad handwriting there. But alert versus one-on-one. -on -one. He ends up taking it. He's got one-on-one. -on -one. Takes Jerry Judy. Judy wins. Really good catch. Way to maintain focus because his foot kind of gets clipped. So that's a really good job maintaining focus, making a big play. You got to love that. I love this decision by Russ because it's like, hey, you know, we got, you know, it's third down, right? So it's third and critical. Okay, we've got mesh called where one of these guys is probably going to pop open. But if they're heating me up, I'm going to make them pay. I'm going to throw my one-on-one. -on -one. It's exactly what he does. Big time cash by Jerry Judy. Love it, man. Okay, it's the first bad. Or now we're in a bad section. So we had a chunk of good. We're going to have some bad, then we're going to get back into good, but we got a bad here, and we've just got a miss, man. So we're going to work play action, right? We're going to work a little bit of run action, play action here. He's going to choose this. One, I can't say that I'm terribly mad about where he chose to go with the football, but I do love the idea of against off corner, against middle of the field closed coverage, off corner, working this top route that he's got with Jerry Judy here, where it's the crossover, we're going to try to get outside. I just, part of me really likes that more. I can't fully grade this as like terrible because I don't know what they're telling him in the meeting room. I don't know why he decided to go there. But I just don't love trying to throw a timing mag route with a guy whose hips are just ready to break on it when I've got someone like Jerry Judy who's going to end up, you know, crossing this guy over. So don't love that one. This one... We got to cover because this is real bad. Okay, so the Raiders are showing cover one hole, right? They're going to try to pre-snap disguise it. They're going to end up kicking back into more like a cover two Tampa. This guy's going to run the middle. They're going to kick back more to a Tampa look. Listen, we've got Jerry Judy on a corner. A corner is great against cover one hole and cover two, especially third and 16 in the red zone. We have to cut this free. So look, like we got to cut this free, ladies and gentlemen. This is wide open. Russ has got to cut this free. I don't even know why he's starting to scramble over here. His line's staying secure. He's got to cut it free. Instead, we get it. We dump it off. We turn third and 16 into fourth and nine, and we kick a field goal, and we got a shot at a touchdown. We got to take that opportunity to try to drive a touchdown there, in my opinion. 
Okay, so I want you guys to watch from the tight. You're going to see how Russ starts to scramble. Not the biggest fan of this, honestly. Of like, hey man, the pocket was clean. Drive the corner for a touchdown. Or give us a shot at a touchdown. This one just flat out bad. We get destroyed on boot here. Okay, I don't know why. We ran a bunch of run where we sorry we had a bunch of run plays where we just left Crosby free and he was gonna and he was bending and running and chasing so then the only boot play we run we decide to keep a tight end back there so then Crosby swims him works outside and destroys Russ on boot like that was mind-boggling it looked nothing like the run plays that we had dialed up it doesn't make sense at all it just doesn't make sense at all. It looks nothing like the run game. So instead, we get the end result of it doesn't look like run. So we don't play it like run and we just get our quarterback rock. So that was just terrible. I had to highlight that one. This one, I, I, I we got a little flash fake to the left. I have no idea why Russ comes off of Jerry Judy. Okay, so I want you guys to look. Boom, as I start to Jerry Judy. I have no idea why you come off Jerry Judy. He's outside releasing this backer who's pushing way vertical. We can fit this ball in. Makes no damn sense to me. We get off him instead, and then we go throw the one-on-one, -on -one and we almost take out the water cooler with our throw. That just doesn't make sense to me. We got a, our first progression. The vertical's wide open. Take the seam. Take the seam. It's right there. Why his eyes would get off makes no sense. There's nothing about, like, it doesn't make sense. But his eyes get off, it works. The other seam doesn't like it, then gets outside, almost kills. Yep. We almost kill the ref. We, we already lost the ref. We almost lost another one right there. <clears throat> Miss on the mag route. We can't have it, man. Okay? We've got a great little sit here. We're going to work the mag behind it. Russ does a great job getting to the right guy, and we just dirt it. Okay? We kill a prairie dog. Can't have it. <clears throat> I have a headache. This is making me mad. Making me so mad. Just no idea. I have no idea where why we're lined up here either. Like, I have no idea why we're hitting our foot down here. Like, to me, this looks like we're trying to drive the ball right here. And then we short hop it outside. It's just bad. Portland Sun probably needs to become come a little bit flatter too, but no matter what, that's hitting him in the shins. And it's not a protection throw. That's a bad throw. Okay, now we're back to some good. Okay, we got a good little cover two hole shot. This guy's going to end up getting baited, trying to jump the Jerry Judy flat route, and we and Russ sees it. Boom. Gets it up and down. We probably had three more of those that we could have hit. Okay? We ended up completing the flat or completing that little out, that little stick route. But we probably had three others that we could have tried to drill the hole shot on. We didn't do it. So, that's that, if you want to know my opinion on it. This one's a big-time throw. Big-time throw. Big-time throw. We got four verts. You're going to read this thing inside out. One to two to three. Russ does a really good job getting to Jerry Judy. Boom, sees it, drives it. Judy makes a great job. Catch, slides in, touchdown. Good stuff from Jerry Judy, man. You Broncos fans are tough on him, and I get it. The guy's had some drops, but he's also made some plays, and he's also been open on tape. And that we haven't gotten him the football. So let's maybe pump the brakes a little bit on the Jerry hate, huh? This is a good football here. That's a heck of a catch, though. Heck of a catch. Last one I've got for you guys, is a, it's a deep curl, right? You're going to see Cortland Sutton does such a good job. Watch him wrap this backer. Look at him work, wrap the backer. Really good throw by Russ. Good little run after catch for Sutton. That's a good, that's good football. That's good football. Let's see it from the tight. Hits the top of his drop, gets the ball out. Good stuff, man. Under pressure, makes a big-time throw. Really good job by Cortland. Love that, love that, love that. Oh, no, I got one more for you guys. Might be my favorite clip. KJ Hamler, man. You guys, if you watch this channel a lot, you know how much I love him. Let's go ahead and watch him step on the toes. Gets vertical, sells it to the corner, gets to the post, runs by everybody in the NFL. <clears throat> great throw by Russ, really good catch by KJ. I just love this kind of stuff where we turn KJ free and let him stretch the defense vertically. I don't know why we don't do more of it. Makes no sense to me. We didn't do enough of it before with the old staff with him. We're still not doing enough with it. Turn one free, man. 
Look at him get on people. He gets on the toes. He crosses people over. It's big time stuff. Really good throw by Russ there. Love that. Okay. So all in all, where are we at? Okay. We've got to do one. We got to do a better job establishing the run. We got to do a better job in our screen game. We have to do a better job. Oh, I want more tempo. The end of the first half drive that we had was probably the best drive we had all day. We need to see more tempo if this Broncos offense is going to come alive. Because right now, we ain't cutting it with what we're doing. We need more tempo. I do think Russ can figure it out and will figure it out. Um, but I think this is a, a, a team deal. Hackett's got to put in more tempo. Russ has got to embrace it. And we've got to stop missing some of these openings we have. Like, especially the third and 16, where I got Jerry Judy on a corner that works against cover one hole and cover two. No reason for our eyes to not be there and we're not there. So, listen... Uh, comment below. Let me know what you think. I'm kind of salty, probably like you guys too. I, I, you know, but that's where we're at. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Comment below, and then until next time, peace.